Have you ever wondered how your electric and gas usage are measured? An electric meter measures the amount of electricity that a home uses. Electric usage is measured in kilowatt hours or kWh. The meter is read daily via hardwired communications through the power lines. This is called a power line carrier, not RF. Your digital meter will display your current meter reading. If you have a large service, 400 amps or greater, you may have a multiplier. The actual voltage or current used is often too large to be registered by your meter. Therefore, it must be stepped down for the meter to measure it and step back up to reflect actual usage. Your electric bill is then calculated by multiplying the amount of electricity you use in kWh. The actual voltage or current used is often too large to be registered by your meter. Therefore, it must be stepped down to measure it and step back up to reflect the actual usage. Your electric bill is then calculated by multiplying the amount of electricity you use in kWh, taking into account any multipliers times your current electric rate. This system is extremely accurate and is regulated by the Wyoming Public Service Commission. If you've signed up for Lower Valley Energy Smart Hub, you may view your daily reads and usage via your computer or on your device. Your gas usage is measured in almost the same way. The gas meter measures the gas being used in the home in 100 cubic feet. You will see a register on your gas meter that will show you your current reading. Then we'll convert the 100 cubic feet measurement into thirds. Using the meter multiplier and the altitude factor specific for your meter, your gas bill is then calculated by multiplying the gas therms used times your current gas rate. If you have any questions on metering and usage, please call Lower Valley Energy at 307-885-3175 or 307-733-2446. Our customer service reps will be happy to help you with any questions you might have. Stay tuned for more Lower Valley Energy videos and remember, your future is bright with Lower Valley Energy.